Hey everyone, welcome to part 3 of programming in Visual Studio 2015. I'm gonna get a bit more deeper into programming and it's more fun that way. And I hope you, you have watched my previous episodes on this video, on this series, so it's gonna be, you're gonna need the gonna keep some annotation in the screen somewhere so you can go back and watch them again I mean you can pause this video and uh oh okay so let's just get started application tree okay see I'm gonna make a software that can calculate and I mean do some simple calculations like plus and subtraction addition subtraction multiplication yeah, like that so first I would need a button I would need levels yeah. and for this I would also make an option for the user to enter the numbers so let's say I'm gonna add a two text box and I'm going to ask. okay so I just did some change in the properties and here we gotta add level 3 level 3 needs to be empty now it's there and let's judge programming and level 3 dot tag equals to val it's only the values in level I mean checks box 1 dot text plus the value of text box 2 dot start say q and 5 7 7 so simple let's change the type Let's change the output type this time. Instead of making it level 3, which is gonna come in a message box. And it's the box. And it's gonna be another bracket. And it's okay. Okay, now let's can I'm just I'm just gonna say that you can add things like the number is number is nine. Oh, it's gonna be a space here so that can get space. You, you got me. So. I'm writing this code, it was my first code ever. I mean, not this one, the, the one with the label. Uh, that was my first code ever wrote. It was in Visual Basic 6.0, the old version of all this. It was it just got me inspired on programming it's hard. I'll gonna fix that later. You know, I, I, I just wanna say that you can change things like the plus to minus and it's gonna do that like 4 minus 3 and multiplication 
deviation they are all the same so I really would like that you to make your own calculator with all the with more options and stuff so that you can learn from it it's a really good example maybe in the next episode I'm gonna make another software but some, some other program and thanks for watching hope this video was helpful leave a like if it was and I'm just saying and too many times sorry about that see you in the next video